Hey, this is Tracy with Color Me This. Welcome to my channel and welcome back to returning viewers. I have been working on my daily color in the Small Victories Joanna Basford coloring book and I am taking a little mini break to give you guys a whole video from Timu. I I'm short some cases, so I finally found some good deals. First, I needed to get a case for my new Brute Funer 520s, so I'll share that one in a minute. And then two are just really good deals. Normally, a case that's a 250, which is how I originally stored all of my pencils, I would uh, put two sets you know, two 120s in a 250 case, and I had three, four of them. And so I finally found another great deal. I don't need another 250, but for the $10.18, it was well worth it. And it just happens to be my favorite color, which is green. And it even came with this lovely strap. None of my 250s have a strap. And this particular case has these really nice little hangy things to clip the strap to. The quality of this is really good. Now this particular case came bubble wrapped and then wrapped in a black bag that was shipping taped and it was really hard to get out. So this one is in the best condition of the three that I bought. So again, $10.18, my strategy is I just go through Timu periodically. I have like a laundry list of things that I like to shop for, pencil cases being one of them. And so I got this 250. I do need a case for the Brute Funers and I the only case I have available right now is my what I call my working case that I do projects with. Uh, it has been out in the garage many times for me to zip off the paint if I have to hand write the numbers on my sets and if I am doing labels that kind of thing so that case the spine is broken down a bit so I wanted to get my group funers out of there because I have to do some more praying labeling projects but I want to have the case empty when I do that the next one that I bought it ends up it it was just in a plastic zip bag and what I don't like about this one is if I get the angle right you can see that there's these marks and the because the surface is like a vinyl it has actually marked the vinyl itself in shipping having you know like actually put a little dent that it's not gonna go away so this was six dollars and thirty eight cents and it is a 72 case and I bought this for my Arteza set because of the condition of the vinyl I will be getting my refund and it's a 50-50 chance that Timu will want me to ship it back but I definitely am not going to accept it. Hub says oh you should just accept it it's a really good price but it's kind of the principle of the thing they keep shipping things in a in a cheap thin plastic bag with no protection whatsoever and sometimes this is what happens so I will be refunding that one and then I want to share that I did find again in the green rose I found a 500 case individual pencil slot for 3308 I think and this was too good a deal to pass up this also was not protected and it is pretty much a, a chipboard material. So it is a, the spine is a little bit flat. It will fill up and I think it'll be just fine. I don't see any other damage with it. I can just feel that where, where these, the elastic straps have been sewn in, if I close it, I can feel the lines because they're, that's the thickest part, but it is soft, it is plush, and so I'm happy with this one. Oh, and I have the strap that came with it, and these cases are more like 
40 to 50, high 40s to 50 uh, on Amazon. So I am very happy with two of my purchases and then the one was kind of a gamble. I did not realize that it was a vinyl-y pleather and I went back and looked and it does say it's, it's a leather, but it's not leather. This is like vinyl, shiny vinyl, not soft leather looking or even pleather. So that's all I've got. I'll be back to doing my daily colors. I finally got my episode number correct. It is 59. Do all the YouTube things. Like, share, comment, and subscribe. And I'm going to see you tomorrow. Or maybe even today. Yeah, because it depends on when I get this posted. But regardless, it will be a second post. And I'm not sure it will be the first of the day or the second video of the day. And as always, thanks for watching.